Alright guys, so today we'll be doing Project Star. So if you haven't heard of Project Star yet, this is the latest new JoJo game that is coming out very soon. Uh, and it's very much like YBA. So if you liked YBA, I would say this is a game for you because it's very similar. Got some great quests, uh, some great stands, great mechanics, uh, a whole bunch of things that you can do, skill trees and all that. But as far as release date, guys, let's come over to the Discord for the game. The owner or developer, developer and owner, I guess, has put, we plan on releasing Project Star on September 16th. This is most likely a final date. The only way it'll get pushed back is if we run into game breaking issues. Before launch, we don't want to launch and have the game be unplayable. Maximum release date, of course, is September 22nd. Since have promised the game to release before the fall, this will not change. Most likely the release is September 16th though, so get ready for launch. All right, so as I'm recording this, this is September 15th and it will be released and I'm releasing this video on September 16th. So for those of y'all who are seeing the video right now, this morning, or whenever you see it, it could be releasing today or the game could be already released. But it seems like come September 22nd, that the game will definitely be released then, if not, right now <laughs> so uh we'll be hopping in today getting the latest sneak peeks from the game having some fun just doing whatever so head on over to my channel guys we have 105,000 subscribers thanks to y'all cannot wait to see how quickly we can get to 200,000. only y'all can make that happen so let's go ahead and hop in so when i last left off i had star platinum and we just finished the mission where you go and speak to uh the this is what uh the Stardust Crusaders part where you're talking to Joe Star, uh, and we our next mission is to get with Captain Nico, but he says that we need to train a little bit more before we hit, get this mission. So we need to get some more missions. I'm not sure if Noob Wagon actually would give me some, but he says Epic Duck is coming. No, but there is a mission over here with this dude with the question mark. So we'll do this one first and see where we're at. Uh, we might uh, try to get some better stands. Um, let's see, because I will be actually later in a few hours, I will be releasing another video on the um, beginner's guide to this game, guys. So don't miss that out, especially if you're going to be playing this game. That's something you're going to want to watch uh, by the time the game releases. So uh, where is it? Someone stole all the cactus juice. What is cactus juice? Uh, one of the most delectable juices found in the deserts. How could you have not heard of it? All right, anyways, yes, let's uh, go find the cactus juice. Now, one good thing I do like is there are, okay, you see where it says the studs over there? There are, um, it does tell you where to actually go for the mission. So we're not that far away. And one good thing I did is I kind of increased my agility for my character because you do have a character map. That's all gonna be explained in the video for the beginner's guide. So is this work? Yeah, cactus juice is right here. And then we just got to return it and don't know if he'll give us good levels. I'm level 22 right now. I don't know if that'll be enough to get us over to where the uh, captain, was it Captain Nico? Will actually give us some stuff. If not, we'll go find us another mission and we'll do that. And hopefully we'll have enough levels to get, uh, I don't know if it's level 25 or 30 where Captain Nico will actually let us play with him. Uh, so, Yes, uh, juice, I gave you blah, blah, blah. I'm not, wait, 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 did it say, did it say something else? Okay, we don't have another mission. So that did not get, even get me to level 23. He didn't give me jack squat. All right, so that's because that is actually probably a beginner mission. Uh, he has something else for me. Are we just gonna go get something or can we fight somebody? I think we're, if he doesn't, okay, I'm not gonna fetch some scorpion meat. Uh, no, let's go actually find us another mission and do some fighting because that's actually a lot more action. So here's an NPC that we are going to uh, do his mission for. Let's see, those jerks beat me up and messed with my bike. That sucks. Well, it does. Could you do me a favor and teach them a lesson? I'll pay you. Sure. Where are they at though? Motorcycle gang uh, punks. Uh, which is it? Because that is my, I want to say it's probably this one. So yeah, 300 studs this way. The scorpion one I, I went and grabbed just for the heck of it is over there so as you can see there are different colors i can't exactly remember what colors go for which but i'll have to look that up i think one of them's like daily or a one one of them's like a daily quest one of them's like a one-time quest uh something similar 
to that to denote the different quest. If I can get to this one, we can actually do it. Oh, here, here's the gang members. All right, so we have Star, uh, star Platinum. We can actually try to do some combo. If I can, I was gonna try to combo them. Dude, no, that ain't gonna work. Starfinger took both of them down, like knocked both back. Watch this ground slam. This ground slam is freaking, well, I did it a minute ago and it actually was pretty cool. But we're gonna do Aura Barrage. And then we're gonna, well, that's a pretty nice barrage. Then we're gonna do, I was gonna try to combo it uh, to a heavy punch. Like do my, some M1s and combo it to a heavy punch. Doesn't look like that worked too well. Starfinger, uh, I don't need to die though. So that's one thing. It's been a, like a month since I've played, so my mechanics on this game might not be exactly what they would be. I would like them to be. Freaking dude blocked it. All right, uh, how much of them do we have to kill or defeat? Four of them? Okay, okay. So let's go Starfinger, then pick him up with a ground slam, get him, and then it picked a dummy up earlier. When I did when I did this, it like looked really sick last time I did this. I don't know why Ground Slam isn't doing what it did earlier. Starfinger, what you gonna block my Starfinger boy? All right. Oh, Ground Slam was not right. Uh, I wasn't close enough. So it's kind of like going for back and forth between ABA mechanic. I'm uh, not. I'm sorry, not ABA mechanics. Like I'm trying to go back and forth between uh oh crap AUT mechanics and this, and it's like crap. I gotta remember what's what. Uh, I'm about to die too. All right, we might want to get our health back before I have to fight some more. All right, I'm gonna just go ahead and kind of try to take this dude on. And as long as I kind of pay attention, hopefully I don't get hurt. I need to step back after my barrage is done. Oh no, 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 he's Starfinger, go. Knock him out, let's gotta run, gotta run. I don't wanna die, I don't wanna die, I'm too young to die. So what I did is I went ahead and just reset uh, okay, why in the world am I not running? I went ahead and reset because I just figured that'd be the quickest way to get my health back. Ah, oh, crap. So the good thing about this game is you don't actually have to hold the E button for your barrage to keep rolling. Now, it might not be a bad idea uh, to to do it. I, like, I do it I do it on just about every JoJo game because I know a lot of them you have to hold it, but then, because it kind of screws me up when I go to do AUT and you have to hold it and it's just, it's kind of crazy. But uh, we have one more to defeat, but I do like the mechanics of this game. It's a little bit more slower paced, I would say. You don't have to be super, super fast paced. You kind of got a little bit of thinking time, but the only thing is like, I would rather, you see how it'd be really, I have to block as soon as this is over with. Oh, of course the time I block, he, uh, the time I block, he decides to be slow on his, on hitting. Oh, uh, crap, 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 heavy punch. And then, can we finish him off with a ground slam? Oh no, he's dead already. All right, so now we just gotta go back to the guy who gave us the quest, and we will have our quest completed. And as you can see, guys, after I've completed the quest, it actually gave me uh, the marker on the map of where the guy is I need to go. So I do like that. You're not wandering around aimlessly trying to find stuff. It's actually pretty neat. All right, thanks, I appreciate it. We got to level 23, and what we can do is we can go to our skill tree. One thing I need to actually look at leveling up is where is vitality? Increase your health, uh, then you have regen. So we have two skill points. We're basically just gonna add them here. And we have one, we can, okay, look, vitality two, increase our health. So regen be something good to get. That's what I'm gonna be working on next after that last fight. You can also do like defense and stuff. So I guess we can go ahead and work on the scorp. Oh, is he gonna give me? Is he gonna give me another quest? No. We can go ahead and fight the scorpions, I guess, just for the heck of it. And that probably be the end of the video. We'll see how those things go. So I've actually had to go a decent way, a pretty decent way for the scorpions. Uh, go, 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 go. I forgot how I fight, fought them before when I was weaker. They're actually not that strong. So. The biggest thing is, is try not to get hit before they die. Good, good, good. So one thing would be nice is, I don't know if you can really combo like Starfinger into, like from the barrage. So we're gonna do Starfinger right now because he was so close and then a uh, heavy punch. Boom, see look, they're dying actually pretty quick. Uh, a couple of M1s probably do really good. What the crap? 
I guess my M1 was, I don't know, it wasn't, it wasn't doing what I wanted it to do. Look at that. Ground Slam took it out pretty good. M1, gosh, oh crap, I thought he was dead. I was about to say, what the heck? So where's the other Scorpions at though? That's the thing, uh, a little bit, I don't know if the respawn rate needs to be higher because it wouldn't be good if you like all of respawned it at once on you. Finally, they are back. So Scorpions, this is your moment. Well, at least one of them is back. Dead Comet, he got me. All right, Starfinger for the finish. All right, Star Platinum, I want to say is a two and a half percent chance of getting him. So I wouldn't say he's like super rare, but he's definitely more on the rare side. All right, here we go. Scorpion, go down, ground slam, boom. I'm just, just doing whatever right now. And they're dead. So then we'll go back and get our quest. As you can see, it's about 700 away. So we will hop to that. All right, now that we got the scorpions done, we need to go talk to this guy again. I don't think he's going to give us much when it comes to experience because he is a beginner level quest that I just did not do. All right, uh, and what are you gonna give us? Boom, he didn't give us jack squat. <laughs> so uh, it was experience, but it wasn't much at all. I hope you enjoyed the video, guys. If you did, make sure you drop a like and subscribe. I will be doing more of this game probably when it releases. So uh, uh, I think it's gonna be really fun. Make sure you go favorite the game, join the Discord, show these dudes some love because this is going to be a really good game. So thanks for watching and God bless you.